we decided it's time to have a you know, worship community uh, for people that you know didn't fit into the to the normal um, Sunday morning hour and a half kind of worship service. We wanted something more personal, and uh, that's why we're here. I think church in the morning and church in the evening are the same. It's church. I'm not a morning person. It's as simple as that. Um, I've got a lot of stuff going on in the evening, not only Boy Scouts, um, you know, we're camping and spending the night, so Sunday morning's not available at least once a month. Yeah, and it's more casual. We, you know, we all speak to each other and share worship like it's, uh, like, it's family. like it's dinner time with the family, exactly. And uh, so we come and relax. It's not so structured and everybody is free to communicate and share and it works great that way. So the prayers that we're doing are actually for my neighbor who's right across the table from me. And I'm praying for her and her family and, and her health. Or I'm praying for their son or their grandson. Or, or, and they're praying for my son and my family. And it's so personal. I haven't been able to get that really in a big church. But sitting across from my neighbors, uh, I can give a prayer to them and receive a prayer from them and feel it's real. They like to go on mission and that this is the place for us to be because we love to be involved with that kind of stuff. Service and is really important to us. Yeah, we're not only building homes, we're, we're building lives back up that have been, you know, potentially destroyed. Mission you know, just going to places we've never been before, going to Alaska, going to Florida, New York, Midwest, you know, disasters happen everywhere, locally. We're going, you know, we're going up to the foothills where fires have ravaged communities. We're going to go help, and that's our neighbors. So um, that's, that's what we have to do and to look forward to for years and years and years. Disasters will always come. Hardship will always be there. Um, and we're going to be there to respond. You know, the power of mission work is, is just that powerful and it changes lives for the better, both ours and theirs. That's why we do it. Exactly.